as bearers of the priesthood, we've been placed on earth in troubled times. We live in a complex world with currents of conflict everywhere to be found. We, who've been ordained to the priesthood of God, can make a difference. When we qualify for the help of the Lord, we can build boys, we can mend men, we can accomplish miracles in His holy service. Our opportunities are without limit. Though the task to be a fitting example and to help others looms large, we're strengthened by the truth. And I quote, The greatest force in the world today is the power of God as it works through man. Close quote. If we are on the Lord's errand, brethren, we are entitled to the Lord's help. Never forget that truth. That divine help, of course, is predicated upon our worthiness. Each must ask, are my hands clean? Is my heart pure? Am I a worthy servant of the Lord? We are surrounded by so much that is designed to divert our attention from those things which are virtuous and good and to tempt us with that which would cause us to be unworthy, to exercise the priesthood we bear. I speak not just to the young men of the Aaronic priesthood, but to those of all ages. Temptations come in various forms throughout our lives. Brethren, are we qualified at all times to perform the sacred duties associated with the priesthood we bear? Young men, you who are priests, are you clean in body and spirit as you sit at the sacrament table on Sunday and bless the emblems of the sacrament? Young men who are teachers, are you worthy to prepare the sacrament? Deacons, as you pass the sacrament to the members of the Church, do you do so knowing that you are spiritually qualified to do so? Does each of you fully understand the importance of all the sacred duties you perform?